No, come on, tell me. It's just something you're gonna tell me about the ligamentium tree. What, what the fuck is a ligamentium tree? Right. Ligamentium tree. That's the term. Anyway, the human body is flawed because, for one thing, the the, the valves in the heart are are placed wrong. For 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 the design of the tricuspid and the mitral valve. The reason they have to be replaced is because they're in the wrong position for the work load to put there. But anyway, ligamentum tree. Your liver is actually held in place in your body. It's it's like a kind of like a sinew yeah. that goes around your liver. And is there like fat involved too, like with the kidneys, yeah. like padding it into place and stuff like that? A little that? bit. Okay. A little bit, but not enough. Basically, take a uh, a piece of uh, a meatloaf. Yeah. Wrap a piece of twine around it. Okay. The twine will support the meatloaf to a point until there's enough force put on the meatloaf. Like uh, pull it up really quick, and what happens? The meatloaf crumbles. That cord cuts right into the meatloaf. Yeah, yeah, totally, yeah. Which is what happens in a car accident. Oh. A lacerated liver. Oh, okay. I thought it was just from like blunt trauma or something, no, or like. It's oh, actually, okay. When your body stops, your internal organs keep going for that. And then the ligaments cut into them that are yes. support, like the supportive exactly. framework and all the supportive that's tissue and stuff. Oh, that's interesting. That's what happens in a lot of things. Like I said, huh. it's not a very good design. Well, I guess it wasn't designed with automobiles yeah, in mind. It's not designed for <laughs> it worked. Travel it worked. Mind. It worked the other way around. We designed yeah. that for us. Yeah. <laughs> so, um, so I shouldn't push into my abdomen because I'm going to stress my ligamentum tree. Is well, that a the thing? Is that you really want to be pushing on that meatloaf when it's resting against the uh, the twine? The twine, as swollen as that meatloaf might be. <laughs> I guess that's a good point. The recent activities. Well, you know, I don't have hepatitis or anything, so that's a. Uh, well, I'm not saying sign. that, right? You probably right. do have an enlarged liver. I feel like I do. I showed you the stretch marks on my right side, right? You've seen those? It's probably your liver. Really? You know, I was thinking it might be my intestines because the right side of your colon distends and the left side doesn't. So I thought, like, maybe because of how low it was, because I was thinking if they were liver related, they'd probably be higher up. The like the fundus of the liver would be like pushing out, like to the wall or whatever, you know. It all depends on your just your anatomy. Yeah. I guess that makes sense.